Welcome to this video. My name is Oasis, and I want to show you one of the applications that I created recently. Now, if you're a YouTube content creator, this video is for you. I'm going to show you one of my YouTube videos first and explain to you what this YouTube time called generator application helped me to do when I create YouTube videos. So here is my Angular crash course. This is about three hour long video. Now to help viewer to navigate to this video properly, I added these chapters. So if I click on this button here, you will see we have all the chapters and you know it helps the user to you know navigate within the video for example if they want to jump into you know components they can click on this components and then this video will start from that particular time to add these chapters to your youtube videos you have to put these timestamps in your description now these timestamps can be really hard to type manually like if i want to make sure that i type the right time with the proper formatting so the youtube understand these as timestamps and then create chapters for my videos i want to have to make sure that i type 00 colon 00 colon 00 and then the title of that timestamp now these can be written manually obviously but because my videos are long and it was taking a lot of time to create these timestamps i actually spent some time to create an application using plain html css and javascript to help me you know write these timestamps quickly so i created this application which is available on this youtube time code dot .io. so this is my website but I created a subdomain for you know this application hosting and this is available for anybody out there who wants to generate timestamps very very easily now I'm going to refresh this page and it's very easy to use so what I'll do is I'll just say course introduction and I press enter once I press enter you will see the properly formatted timestamp is written for us on the right I'm going to type some timestamp very very quickly so i'll say angular components i press enter it is going to give me this alert saying increment the time now the reason for that is because we already have a timestamp for this time so basically it will help you to actually not repeat the same timestamp for another title so i will type in angular components press tab on a keyboard which will focus on the time input field and i'll say zero hour and this starts from 20 minutes 45 seconds i press enter and we get to see another timestamp i'll type back in the title area which is going to be angular directive press tab and this is going to start from one hour 10 minutes and 35 seconds i press enter and you'll see after creating the timestamp, it will focus automatically on the title input field. So this is like really easy to create time codes. So you just type it, enter, you have to increment the time and I will increment it by one second, enter, and you will see. Now, once you generate all this time code, all you gotta do is just copy this and put those into the description of your uh, YouTube video. I actually tried searching online if something like this exists. And I tried a lot of Google searches, but I couldn't find any. So that's why I created one. And I hope this will help people uh, having a YouTube channel and having to create chapters in their videos. This is going to make their life easier. So I hope you like the application and go ahead and then visit this YouTube timeco.oismizer.io. This application has no ads. It's free to use. And let me know in the comments below if you like this idea and because I couldn't find any. So yeah, enjoy the application and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.